In this video we'll have a brief discussion and demonstration of the control protections that are available to Airbus A320 series aircraft when in normal law. First of all, we're going to look at the bank angle protections available to us on this aircraft. We're going to start by making a roll to the right through the graduations of 10, 20, 30 degrees. Settling at 33 degrees, stick free, but the aircraft will maintain the attitude. Beyond this, it does not auto trip. At 45 degrees, the flight directors disappear. We'll keep that roll going now, all the way to 67 degrees, which you can see is marked by the two green lines on the edge of the PFD. We're now going to roll wings level. Flight directors reappear at 40 degrees. We're going to deselect those for the remainder of the manoeuvres. Bring the nose back up towards 10 degrees and commence a roll to the left hand side, this time without pausing. Through 10, 20, 30, 45, all the way to 67 degrees. Nose is dropping now through the horizon, rolling wings level. And now we're going to keep this energy for the next manoeuvre. Well, let's use this additional energy to demonstrate the pitch and load factor protections available. So with the additional energy, I'm going to pull full back stick and see the maximum pitch attitude I can maintain. Uh, with full back stick, we will reach 30 degrees and no further. The aircraft will limit the G to 2.5 G if we are clean and plus 2 G if we are configured. As you can see, a dangerous situation with the speed bleeding rapidly, so let's push that nose down and see the maximum nose down pitch attitude we can maintain. Now with full forward stick, the aircraft will pitch down to 15 degrees below the horizon and no further. Keeping the high airspeed, we're now going to move on to look at high speed protection. Coming to sight now, the two green bars just underneath 360 knots on the speed tape, they show us the point at which the high speed protection will engage. The bottom of the red and black stripe bar shows us the point at which the aircraft will reach its overspeed at 350 knots. The warning will go off at plus 4 knots. And as we hit the two green bars, the aircraft will increase the pitch attitude. Stick free, no hand on the side stick. As you can see, it's moving towards the horizon and the speed is decreasing to maintain VMO. That's the maximum operating speed. Now let's take a look at the high angle of attack protections that are available. We are gently decelerating. Uh, we're going to decelerate below BLS, which is the lowest selectable speed. Uh, which is essentially a safe margin on the stall speed of the aircraft. As we decelerate further, we go into the alpha protection range, which is between V alpha protection and V alpha max. In this range, the auto trim will no longer provide any nose up additional trim, and the side stick demands alpha directly. So, with the side stick released, the aircraft will return to V alpha protection and stay there. If we continue to pull back on the stick, we increase the angle of attack demand and increase it all the way until we reach V alpha max. Between V alpha protection and V alpha max, alpha floor will trigger, which demands full power from both engines. So with the stick full back, we now have the aircraft maintaining V alpha max with turbo thrust. As we can see now from the FMA, it's flashing an amber box around toga lock in the top left corner. This mode follows the activation at alpha floor, with the engines commanded to maximum thrust. To disconnect this, we need to move the thrust levers to an appropriate position and press the instinctive disconnect buttons. Well, let's demonstrate those protections again, but this time let's configure for the approach. So we now have moving through flap one, flap two, gear down. Flap three, and finally, flap four. Decelerating gently, as you can see again, we are going to move below VLS into the alpha protection range. A 
Again, as we decelerate into the alpha protection range, this side stick demands alpha directly. And if I continue to pull the side stick all the way back, the aircraft will maintain V alpha max and no slower. As earlier, alpha floor is triggered, providing toga power on both engines.